Curtis People's Top. This, that's, the last one was Tony Lucata. <laughs> Halt to tell me to kill me for that. Um, Curtis People's. Curdy Kurt is such an absolute sweetheart. Like he and I, if, 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 the, if the two of us didn't have somebody to just go, all right, you're gonna do this and you're gonna do that, the two of us would be like, no, it's fine, why don't you do, oh no, well, how about you do, are you sure you wanna do this? But, but if you don't want to, then it'll be fine. Th that would be our entire relationship. And you know what, I love that because it makes me feel really comfortable because it's like me. Um, but no man, Kid writes amazing songs. He is so sweet and kind. And I just, I love him. Um, and again, someone who um, I'm getting to know better and better just as this specific tour goes on, and I'm so happy. Um, I'm Curtis. Curdy P. Oh, I love him. He's so sweet. His songs are so, so catchy. The song is so catchy, and I love his style. He plays with Slim, and they're perfect perfect match, the perfect combo. So they just need to do that all the time, stick together and but his songs, I love, I absolutely love, love, love his songs. But like he can he can write for like other people. I don't know if he even does that. But he should just write he should write do a lot of songs for other people. Has he done that? He's, he's mentioned that he's done a song and he's been trying to pitch to someone. Yeah. But because his yeah. song yeah, his songs. I swear I, I like, I haven't heard this on the radio, and sometimes I think he's covering other people's songs, but it's just that catchy, you know? Yeah, he's great. Um, Curtis Peoples, I uh, know. Right. Uh, um, Curtis, Curtis came by the studio that I was working in on my first record with a guy who played, he, he played uh, piano. Dave, he, he played, he plays with Curtis, I think, still. And he played, Dave played, piano and organ on my first record a lot of it and Curtis is a good friend of his. Curtis came by the studio, he was really cool, the sweetest guy I could, you know, you could hope to meet. He was a really, really nice cat. Really nice cat. Curtis is, is one of the most likable dudes that the LA music scene has amongst them. Um, he, uh, yeah, he writes really great pop songs and uh, has one of the most extensive pop uh, pop record catalogs in his iPod. His iPod is really something. Um, but uh, but yeah, man, he's a hustler. He's a total hustler. He's a he's a very yeah diligent. Uh, um, opportunist, you know, whenever there's an opportunity for him to shake hands with someone or or uh, get to know someone, meet someone, promote his music, be at the right place at the right time, he seems to have an incredible knack for that. Um, real nice to travel with, very agreeable, and, uh, you know, again, an, an inspiration as well, and watching him hustle and put his, his heart into his music and his work. Um, even though I've, I've kind of been at it longer, there's always something to learn from, from someone else and the way they go about doing it. And, and I, I can honestly say I've learned a bit from, from, from Curtis Peoples. So I, I like traveling with them, I like touring with them. And uh, we seem to do real well together as far as sharing a lot of same fans and bringing people out. Um, if he's involved, I know the show's going to be promoted. I know people are going to show up, and I know everyone's going to have a good time, so I'm really stoked to be on this tour with Curtis as well. Sunday night, I received the call, ready to give my all. 